not just our experience, though, but that of our entire class. So, what is it that we all have in common? Brayden and I are the embedded Costco states. Well, yes. But we actually realized that what we all have in common is that our high school years were a oh, roller coaster. The day after fun, Tiffany and I went to six flags with some friends, one of which had never been on a roller coaster before. I realized that waiting in line and being a first time rider was kind of just like how we felt when we were incoming freshmen. Think back to 2018. Okay. You're walking into Joliet West, maybe for the first time, for all the freshman orientation activities. You get your schedule, take your ID picture, probably get it, and then walk through the halls to try and find your classes for the first day. You'll likely still be lost, but you're excited because this is the beginning of our high school roller Okay, fast forward a little, now we're getting into the group of high school. It's freshman year, we're on the ride. We know the way to all of our classes, we're starting to know the building names, and all the kids are going to drop AP Hunt have already dropped. <laughs> While on the ride, this is when most of us started to get involved and find our friends. Joining clubs and teams while knowing no one is terrified at first. Joining the worst thing can happen is you don't enjoy something. Well, in which case, you're simply not going to get involved in a different program. There are only positives in becoming a part of a close-knit group. We were lucky enough to be a part of the drama department here at West. But we're both involved in plenty of other activities. The majority of our time was spent inside the little theater over these four weeks. Having somewhere you feel safe and happy is crucial, and I hope we all continue to seek out and find these places moving forward. Often what makes these places so special is the people we share. If high school the roller coaster, then the friends and teachers we connect with along the way are the people we rode alongside. Specifically, they're the people that we see in the picture at the end of the run, the ones we're holding on to for dear life. Now, whether your time at West has been a two-seater, a four-seater, or one of those water bikes that you can your family to set, you specifically take the people that are around you and surround yourself with the people who made you into the person you are right now. With this in mind, make sure to stay in contact with your friends and reach out to past teachers. Be willing to keep and further those connections for life. Moving on is important. These friendships and memories will always be a crucial part of who we are. Now, I think it's obvious that one of the most memorable aspects of our time at Julia Rutgers. Sophomore year, at least in my eyes, was supposed to be the easiest year of high school. The SATs worked until next year, there wasn't so much pressure to be thinking about your future, and maybe you weren't taking quite so many AP classes. We were all just filled with anticipation as the roller coaster began to take us up. And then, the ride dropped. COVID happened and we lost over a year of time together. Our roller coaster was closed for maintenance while we were stuck with our feet dangling below us. We missed out on a crucial time together, and we were supposed to grow and become adults. But instead, they were stuck at home looking through screens. Now, don't get me wrong. Virtual reality can be great, but you don't really get the same experience if you're not truly on the ride. However, not all of this is bad. It's a lot easier now to recognize the importance of face-to-face -face social interaction and appreciate the time we have with the people we love. And taking a break from social settings places so much more of an emphasis on mental health than we ever had back in 2018. The skill of recognizing what we personally need will help us continue to grow, change, and succeed. Okay. All good roller coasters have a few such drops and a couple loops. And there have definitely been a lot of loops in the past couple of years. At times, the roller coaster is going in circles, with the mandates changing and the pressure of uncertainty in the world around us. But luckily, all those loops eventually stopped. And now the ride is coming to an end. Our senior year has been a return to normalcy, and although we've lost some time to protect the difficulties, we're lucky to be coming right back to where we started. Even if it is a new normal, we came back to our bus festivals. We got to walk the halls with our friends. We actually had our in-person dance, in dances, and we got to witness the type of the tear it up the dance floor. And now here we are, graduating together. We did it! Today, our roller coaster is going to come to a stop, and we have to exit the ride. But we're already all beginning to more than you. Whether it be trade school, the military, college, the workforce, or something else, it's important to conquer your fears and try something new. Don't spend your future sitting on a bench eating at an incredibly overpriced bubble cake while everyone else moves out and makes the most of them. Unless you're really passionate about bubble But there's one key difference between graduating high school and getting off the road. We're leaving this place with so much more than we can. When you get off a ride, 
you hardly ever have more than you start here. If anything, you've lost the last things that are at or your phone. Or your lunch. But our memories and accomplishments are like souvenirs. The things we take with us to remind us of the most prominent moments that define how we look back on the past four years. Everything from your diploma and pictures from today to your awful freshman ID will remind you of the whole time. Every twist and turn, rise and fall, and the joys and fears and tears of the people that rode alongside you. Now, I know that when I rode with those friends, I often find myself wishing it would have been more. But that's the beauty of all of this. Even though we were getting off this ride, whether you loved every second of it or you had your share of trials and tribulations, we had this time to share together. And we did it together. Now we move on to the next ride. We're getting back in line for the next roller coaster of our lives. We may not know yet who will stick with and share the experience with this time, or what direction it will take us, but we do know one thing. That this new roller coaster will give you just as many opportunities to succeed, make memories, and foster friendships if you only let Personally, our lives could have been nearly as enjoyable and rewarding without all the people in our lives who bought us the tickets. I don't know, the, the metaphor is running out. The people who were there for us every step of the way. Mom, Dad, and Heather, thank you for always pushing me to be my best and being with me through everything. To my grandparents, thank you for always supporting me with all of your endless love. For my grandpa, the countless pride and help you've given our family is appreciated more than you'll ever know. And finally, Sophie, you've been my question for 12 years, and I love you so much. I'm so grateful for all of our memories, and absolutely nothing in my life could be the same. I'd like to thank some of my amazing family as well. Thank you all for being there, Chris, Taylor, and Dave for always being there and your constant support and love for what you got to work with too. For Emma, thank you for making everything I do feel that much more special and fun with your love and excitement. I love you all so much. I thank God for all my blessings and all the amazing people you've put in my life. Dr. Gibson, we thank you for this opportunity to speak to our class and for all the time you've given during your time dedicated as principal to Billy West. We wish you all the best in the future. And most of all, we want to thank Mrs. Kristen Lynn, not only for helping us write this speech, but for being an amazing coach, teacher, and mentor. Seniors, soon to be graduating class of 2022, this next ride will be just as, if not more, not from this one. So don't forget the people you wrote for or everything you learned from. You never know just how valuable a relationship can be, or just how much it meant until it falls out of your pocket on the ride and you don't realize it until like four rides later and you trace your step all the way back to the park just because your pants don't have zippers. Okay, what do we get this means to treasure the relationships you have? Our high school road coaster has been incredible, but now it's time to unbuckle, grab our bags, and head to a new line. This next ride will be ups, down, loops, and maybe it'll even stop again. But these are what made the roller coaster for us. No matter how tall, or fast, or scary it may seem, Every ride has something different and something to teach you. So make sure you always get on that next roller coaster. And not only that, but throw up your hands in the air and enjoy the ride. We were hoping to get a quick selfie with the Saturday Dragon Day 2 for you. Stay with that. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you, Brady and Tiffany. They are the um, first group of speakers who I actually um, did not get to hear in advance. Uh, they worked with Mrs. Blake, and I think they did an amazing job. And I watched Brady time himself and then Tiffany because I told them they needed to leave it to 10 minutes. And I so, even though we are a smaller group than normal, please remember that each one of our graduates and their family members deserve to hear the student's name. Please remain quiet during the presentation so that they can do so. At the end of the presentation, we will applaud and cheer each and every graduate. Class of 2022, the 58th class of Joliet West High School, please rise.
graduation and set forth by the state of Illinois and the Board of Education of the Joliet Township High School. Dr. Gibson, on behalf of the JTHS Board of Education, I accept the class of 2022 for the presentation of diploma and congratulate the families and the students. Liliana Carranza, Suma Cunare. Bridget Carr. 
Jesus Dias da Roa. Nathan Parker of the Human Club. Nadia Dias. Brittany Clark, Magdalene Kumba. Ella Dias, Kumbare. Nathan Clemente, Magdalene Kumba. Aiden Dias. Nathan Cobb. Stephanie Delatore, Magdalene Kumbare. Madison Collins, Magdalene Kumba. Madison Del Rosario, Magdalene Kumbare. Brooklyn Clark. Regina Dawkins, Magna Cum Laude. Rashad Collins Johnson. Ivan Davis. Robert Cook, Magna Cum Laude. Emmanuel Dabwa, Sume Cum Laude. Jose Cortez. Skyler Puda. Vivo Cogliano Cortez, Jose Cum Laude. Taylor Poole. Carson Cup. Katia Frederick, Suma Kumare. Kenya Kuzet. Kenea Frazier. Taylor Frazier, Magna Cum Laude. Andrea Franco Astorga, Magna Cum Laude. Orange Blue Cum Laude. Vivian Franco, Magna Cum Laude. Jonathan Becerra, Cum Laude. Baby Gorman. Andrew Dodd, Suma Cum Laude. Ryan Fisher, Magna Cum Laude. And you, don't talk back, Magna Cum Laude. Colin Farrell. Anthony Fabray. And in two, don't talk about it. Ashley Fabray, Magna Cum Laude. Give me yours, Cum Laude. Sophia Escobedo, Magna Cum Laude. Amelia Dove, Cum Laude. Nailene Esparza. Marius Dumas. Salve LSU. Suma Kumari. Kali Nancy. Suma Kumari. Christian Guzman. Kumari. Juanita Kumari. Jocelyn Guzman. Tomasi Kumari. Maurice Dunn. Kumari. Asia Evans. Macariel Brooks. Olivia Elvis Kumba. Milan Green. Colin Kumba. Kumba. Sir London Granberry. Nada Torino Kumba. Jesus Gonzalez Sanchez. Nana Kumba.